couple weeks ago, I did a post, a really scary post about Berkeley being persuaded to go into a cab with a person he didn't know. And if you didn't see the post, go back and watch it. But um, we had a good outcome. We were able to track Berkeley down and find him. No harm came to him. But it was a really, really scary time. And after that post, I've had a number of people ask me, why? Why would Berkeley get into a cab with someone he didn't know? And there's a couple reasons for that, I believe. One, uh, he used to ride a government-run transportation system, and it would very often become overwhelmed. And so instead of sending one of their clearly marked buses, they would send a limousine or another shuttle service and sometimes a yellow cab. So I think Berkeley had in the past ridden a yellow cab. Again, he didn't want to go. The receptionist reported that he had argued with the man that he didn't want to go. But in the end, and I think this is the greater reason that Berkeley went, is because it was an authoritarian figure. And Berkeley has a lot of authoritarian figures in his life. And it's, it's a struggle because Berkeley isn't capable of making many decisions on his own. But I, I think people just look at him as a small child and everyone thinks that they have the right to tell him what to do. Now, I want to be very careful here because we certainly appreciate um, the network of people that help us with Berkeley, that encourage Berkeley, that love Berkeley. But um, as I thought about this a lot, I thought, you know, one thing that I would probably ask of anybody that surrounds a, a person with a disability is that if that person is doing something and it's not going to cause imminent danger to themselves or someone else, that you reach out to their parents or, or someone like myself who is a, a known guardian and ask them to intervene. Again, you know, you have to use some judgment here if it's going to uh, create a, a, a difficult, like a, a dangerous situation. Yes, and absolutely you need to step in. But um, that's something that if you're um, also bringing up someone with a disability is start educating your friends and the extended family that the, you're trying to establish a little bit of independence in your loved ones so that they know when they can push back and when they should just go ahead and obey. Berkeley is a, is a people pleaser, and so he wants to do what is right. So I hope that kind of clears that up. Um, next week, I'm going to talk about setting boundaries, a completely different kind of boundary. So I hope you'll tune in. You can find me on Instagram at Laura underscore shares. And of course, my YouTube channel, Laura Shares. Would love for you to join and follow me. Thanks.